Good morning, YouTube. I've been missing for exactly like a week now. Like, I have not vlogged in like a month, but I have actually like posted a video up. So go look at that. It's about my life at Fable State. So people had questions on like my major, my cheerleading life. So I just answered all the questions, I think. I think. But yeah, it's, what's today, Saturday? Today is Saturday, December 31st. It's the last day of 2016. Thank God 2016 is over. This was not the year for me. But I'm gonna stay blessed regardless. It might have been a year for somebody else. So, you know, you can't have it all. Um, it's 9.13 in the morning. I got up at 8. Well, really, we got up at like 7.45, right? We got up at 7.45, right? We got up at 7.45 because I have to be at work at 10. Um, and then... I'm packing my stuff and I'm going back to Charlotte because I miss my friends. And yeah, I'm gonna have a good time. I'm gonna be vlogging it all day. I think it's gonna just be a day vlog. Or maybe a two day vlog. Like New Year's Eve and then New Year's. Cause I didn't do Christmas because I was just working. It was gonna be boring. I worked all month of December. And Christmas was quick and different because yeah I'm gonna explain that later but uh, it was good for the most part you know had some good foods so, yeah so my arm got really tired but um Key's over there getting dressed say hi Key hey. <laughs> she ain't getting dressed she doesn't have to work today she is just gonna drive to Charlotte before I do I don't know why she's going so early. Why are you going so early? Oh, yeah, she's getting a hotel. You got to uh, let me know my portion. Um, but I'm not going to put her on camera right now because she drew herself a unibrow to do her eyebrows. Yo, hold on, come here. Coming to the light. Coming to the light. I'm zooming in on you. She got the camera place. Nah, don't try to hide now. To get y'all. Sorry, I'm at my friend's apartment. This is where I've been staying. Until we go back to school. But, um, yeah, she, y'all, she drew a full lap. You know, bro. <laughs> But um, my outfit for work today is my Bible State cardigan, um, a cranberry, like berry, I don't know how to describe this, top, excuse my gut, and some khaki pants, high-waisted pants that I got. Um, got this from Bible State, got this from Kohl's, and got these from H&M. Um, the highway says so you see that gap right there i'm just too late to put them up right now um i don't know what she's gonna wear yet because it's a little chilly but i want to be cute on my last day of 2016. i have to work tomorrow as well uh i just had a update y'all very i'm sleepy um yeah I got a, um, I did some work though for my YouTube channel. I opened up a Facebook page to like my makeup and stuff. So all the looks that I do are gonna be on my Facebook page. Most, some of them are up there now, not most of them. Some of them I've done already on myself and one I did on my cheer sister. Um, Key, you gonna let me be, let me uh, use you as my canvas for makeup? I'm gonna let, I'm gonna do Key's makeup one day and record it and then take pictures. My mom said she's gonna let me do her makeup. Basically, I'm gonna go back to like doing it because I stopped. Because 
Makeup is not cheap. Not cheap at all. Oh yeah, I gotta tell, show y'all what I got for Christmas. I gotta show y'all what I bought for my brother, my mother, and my aunt. Um, I bought some new stuff. I bought some two outfits. I bought two outfits for New Year's. They're the same color, the same fabric, everything. One is just a dress and one is just, um, a two-piece suit, like a two-piece bodycon thing. I don't know. But I gotta take um, the two piece back because I gotta get it fitted to the way I like it. Why? I don't want to wear the dress. It was cute. I mean, so was the uh, the suit. I I gotta figure out what I'm gonna wear. I already know the makeup. Keys in the dress. I'll show y'all what they look like. I mean, I can show y'all now. Let me show y'all now. Let's take a trip. My chick bag. She from uh, huh? It's what? Dollars? That's it? Okay. Tell her I got her. I'll give it to her in cash. Okay. So hold on, let me pull it out. This is key stuff, sorry. Like I said, we were staying at a friend's house. Until the birth is over, let me these outfits together. Sorry if y'all come and see her stuff. Okay. So basically, these are the outfits. He wants me to wear the dress. I like the dress. I got it in a medium, so it fits kind of big on me. And I was going to put um, a waist um, corset, I guess. And some high high knee boots, high thigh boots, they're um tan. Or I was gonna wear this bodysuit. Well two piece, which is cute. But the top fits me good, but I want it a little bit tighter. And the leggings, bottom parts, they don't cover my booty. So I gotta get I got them in medium. But I should have got a large or extra large because you know, how fat he's growing. Um, but I got the top and the small, and like I said, the dress is in the medium, so. She said team dress. What y'all think? Huh? Yep. Mm, no. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. I want to wear pants, because it's going to be cold. I'll be cold. Yeah, she's wearing a dress, too. I'm going I'm to record her when she gets dressed tonight, but I don't know. I don't know, you guys. Both cute. I'm gonna I'm a keep both of them regardless of whatever I'm wearing tonight. Cause I can wear another the other one on whatever other night I decide to go out. But yeah, I haven't been out out in a long time. Like last time I was out, it was the All Black Affair, and I didn't even record that because yeah, it was just a lot going on. But um, I had a good time at the All Black Affair, you know. It was good until people started getting a little too drunk and fighting, but. Mm -hmm. Yeah, bro, she tried to erase the unibrow, bro. Don't, don't, don't try to conceal now. That's her little trick, y'all. I'm zooming in. <laughs> Whenever you mess up and fix everything afterwards, it's gonna be cute. Guys. You giving that tutorial? Yeah. This chick crazy. I don't. Sorry, the cat in the closet. <laughs> Y'all, we don't have a cat. They have a cat. They have a cat, not us. We will not be having a cat. I'm just letting you know. Yeah, we're not cats, having a cat. Cats smell worse than dogs. Yeah, they do. And they're more crazy. Yeah. Y'all see me looking ratchet. She trying to be cute and want me to look ratchet. No, they see me ratchet. They see me without makeup right, before. You see this little ears popping out. Oh, girl, girl. But, um, yeah, Keith, Keith's going to do a brow tutorial maybe on my channel one day. On how she do her brows. Because the way she do it is so funny. Like, that cat is crazy. But the way I do my brows is like, we completely opposite. Like, it's just funny. I don't know why I do it this way. It's easier for me. It's it's funny. I ain't even really do my brows. Let me see this deranged cat. That's his little box. 
Where you go? Oh, dang, he got off his. Dang, he got off his. Say hi, Mandela. She not messing with me today. Good morning, Stinker. Good morning. He like, why you got this camera in my face? Good morning. You okay? Say good morning, Auntie D. Good morning. Good morning. Say hi. He's out of it this morning. Very. Oh. Okay. Bless you. Say good morning. Mm, say good morning. Alright, I'm gonna get you a dance. Alrighty, y'all. So I'm about to go feed this little boy. He's still kind of sleepy. I'm gonna feed him and then I'll talk to y'all later. And I will see y'all in the next clip. Say bye bye. Say bye bye. Say bye, Aki. She gonna be looking better in the next scene. Nigga, <laughs> Key, she finally ready. <laughs> I told him, I promised him I was gonna show you better in the next scene. See her face done. <laughs> no unibrow. You parked right beside me? Look at this, y'all. We parked right beside each other. We're both of our bumpers looking like craziness. <laughs> I ain't mess up your car. You hit that. I wasn't even in the car. <laughs> Big Vila about to die on me, y'all. Pearl. Big Beulah, and this is Pearl. She keep calling her car cocaine, bruh. Yes. Oh, can you drop it down? So I'm back, y'all. Sorry, I left my phone in the apartment. Why is he talking junk? Because I'm vlogging. Like, <laughs> she talking hella cash money. Because I'm vlogging. And she texted me. She would have jamming. That's crazy. But yeah. Okay. So I'm going to Charlotte. I don't know if I told y'all my plans already. I'm going to Charlotte for New Year's Eve. And I'm going with Key, the one you just saw that I've been saying with. Um, we're moving in together. That was big news I had to tell y'all. We're moving in together. We're getting an apartment. Well, we're looking for apartments. We're apartment hunting. Uh, I didn't want to vlog it because I wanted to make sure that my, my coins was right. And I didn't want to embarrass myself on this vlog. But um, we've been looking. I think we found the apartment that we want. But we're still going to be looking. We're trying to make sure our money's right. Because you need to make sure your money's right before you do anything drastic like that. That's an investment. Um, and then I'm so <laughs> bro. She turning up, bro. She is crazy. She is crazy. Oh my gosh. Ah, right, bye. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Y'all, she hitting the folks. I'm trying to drive her one here. She over here hitting the folks. Um, but yeah, like, oh, we're moving into an apartment, so we've been looking. We found a really nice apartment that's like in the middle of everything. So like where our school is, where both of us work, like it's in the smack middle of everything. Cause she works on the other side of town and I work on, technically I work right behind my job. I mean, right behind where I'm staying right now. Like, Cause I really do like literally close is like right there. Um. That's why I'm leaving at 9.50 to be at work at 10 because I could do that, you know. But, um, what was I saying? Yeah, that was the big news. Um, I'm also in the process of finding a new car because Big Beulah's about to die on me, unfortunately. She's been through it all. Literally. So, um... for a new car. I'm not going to tell you what car I'm looking for yet because I think I found it, but you know, like I said, this is an investment. It's two major
major investments right back to back so you girl gotta be patient and make sure her coins are right and make sure your credit is right as well um some motivation on what I'm doing was from the Glam Twins um, on YouTube. Yo, my car is like hesitating. Oh, Jesus, we just gonna pray. She is there. Just last thing to her Charlotte, please. But anyway, um, yeah, some motivation is from the Glam Twins. Check out their channel. I love their channel. Y'all most likely y'all already following their channel. I love their channel. And Aaliyah J. Those are my two favorite channels right now. Um, what else? But yeah, I'm just rambling right now while I'm on my way to work. I got like five minutes to walk into work. And I'll be there in like three. So I will see y'all later. Hey y'all, so it's 4.39. I'm just now trying to get out of Fayetteville. Um, I ended up having, I was supposed to get off of work at 2.45. I ended up not getting off of work until 3.15. Yeah. Um, I, am, I had to run some errands, you know, get ready for tonight, to pack up the car. If y'all can't see in the background, I have my stuff in the car because, yeah. people back because they're calling me a guy that I'm dating calling me making sure I'm okay my mom calling me making sure I'm okay my friends that I'm meeting up for New Year's making sure I'm okay and yeah so I had to call them back and it took forever but um, I'm on my way to Charlotte now um, I had a long day at work it was good but it was just really long and sorry y'all if y'all see a light it's I feel like I'm just too dark right now to be seen on camera, so I got my flashlight going. Oh my god, no you did not. I hate when people do that, like, you cut in front of me and then, oh you a dreadhead nigga. Oh, excuse my language. But, um, anyway, my car is running okay for right now. That's the one thing I would say. If y'all are going to turn up and y'all are legal enough to turn up, make sure y'all are responsible. Do not drink and drive. Like, I don't care if you only have one glass of whatever. Like, have a backup plan. Make sure you're safe. Call an Uber. Ubers only really cost. They start at $5. It depends on where you're going. It depends on what city you're in. But Uber or Lyft, whatever. Call a taxi. Call somebody who hasn't been drinking who's a responsible driver. You know. Cause I'm not driving tonight. I'm not about to risk my life and not even be able to enjoy 2016. I mean 2017 because 2016 wasn't that good to me. Dang, I'm so used to saying 2016. Oh, comment down below if y'all one of those people where like y'all so used to writing 2016 on your papers and stuff like that that you like for the first month you're always like scratching out the six and put the seven or whatever that year it is. Bro, I was struggling to do that. But, um, yeah, it's about, it's about 531 right now, and where am I? I'm in Carthage, I think. Yeah, I'm in Carthage, which is the small little town. Um, I got a full tank of gas, because, you know, girl, got a full tank of gas. Um, my stuff is in the back, my outfit and stuff is all together. Um, 
I think I'm gonna go with the pants suit, like two piece thing right now because I was I didn't have enough time to look for the corset for my dress. And I don't have time to make it. Even though it only takes like five seconds, I just don't have time to make it. To find the material, it's just too much. So I think I'm gonna go with the two piece set. Or I'm gonna see what my friends have, what they brought, and then go from there. Um and plus my mom doesn't want me to get and I don't feel like this is lazy of me and this might be a TMI. I don't feel like shaving my legs right now. I'm not getting any, nor do I plan on it, nor do I want any. I'm happily single right now. Um, I guess you could say I'm dating, but prepared to be single and willing to be single and trying to be single. If that makes any sense at all. But I don't know, no. Let's start 2016 with like, no worries on what he's doing or if he's gonna like me, no. I don't, mm -mm. Nope. We gonna start 2016 on a really, really good, confident note by loving myself. And I think everybody should love their self first and then worry about relationships second. No, third, because your education comes second to loving yourself and taking care of yourself and your family. Um, but uh, I'm just blabbling because ain't nothing on the radio and I haven't talked to you all day, y'all. I work my little butt off. But I got a compliment on my shirt. They said cranberry, like deep plum and cranberry are my colors. I don't know what y'all think. Maybe. Maybe. And I got my nails done. So, uh, y'all might not be able to see it good because I'm driving and this light is like really ratchet. But I'm going to show it later and I'm going to show my other friends. Hopefully they like to be recorded because I never asked them, but I'm sure they do. And it's one of my friends' birthday. So, happy birthday to Ra. You know, I just met her. I met her last year and found out that she's from where well, she lives, where my family's from. Well, my dad's side of the family is from, so we're cool. She's really nice. She's going. Cool she's a New Year's Eve baby, and her friend Chinese is coming, and she's cool. And she's like a banging model. Like she can rip that runway. She's so small, but she walking like she taller than anybody. Like that's who you. That's who you wish you could be. Like that's who you could wish you could walk like. But she's cool. And my girl Keith saw her in the last scene doing her unibrow. <laughs> and we might meet up with some other friends. My friend Ashanti, I miss her. She's been in um, a vlog before. She was in my Thanksgiving vlog, my very first vlog. I don't know where my homegirl Nikki is. I think she's still in, um, in Tennessee with her mother and her daughter and her sister. And spend time with family because, yeah, she lives in Charlotte, but her family doesn't live in Charlotte anymore but um yeah i'm gonna just catch y'all when the writing is good and where i'm not using my phone or anything right and yeah i'll see y'all in the next scene not to cry and I'm not trying not to get upset because 2016 really isn't my year like I hate crying but I'm stranded in the middle of nowhere my car then completely broke down it's New Year's Eve I'm just trying to have a good rest of the year will you be okay sitting here yeah That's my mom's on her way but you're on the road good now you really sitting and you got your flashers on you shouldn't have any trouble with it okay um, I'll leave you here. Like I said, if you need any help, just call. I don't want to hear it.
Right. We're, we're gonna be in the area. So we'll okay. probably see somebody ride up and down a couple times anyway. Okay. All right. Thank you so much. All right. And happy new year. Well, you too. I hope it gets better for you. I'm trying. I hope so too. So y'all, that was just the officer. I didn't want to record him because I don't know if he wanted to be recorded. But I'm stranded in between Albemarle and Locust. If any of y'all know where that is, yeah, I'm just on Red Crossroad, stranded. My car won't accelerate at all. The car will turn on. But it won't accelerate. My engine is pretty much done. I'm really just tired of bad stuff happening to me in 2016. Like, I'm strong. I'm educated. I feel beautiful all the time, but I just am tired as well. Like, I'm so tired. Normally, you know, you're supposed to have a couple bad days, not a bad year. And my phone died on 30%, like... The stuff that happened to me in 2016, I, I wouldn't wish that on my worst enemy. I really wouldn't. And I'm embarrassed for crying in front of y'all, but I just feel like I wouldn't be real if I never cried. Like, I'm strong, but I'm not that strong when it comes to, like, stuff really constantly piling up on me. You know, luckily... My parents have set up a good system where I can call AAA, you know, so I call them, and you know, I know I'm not in trouble with the law or anything, so I, don't, I can call the police, you know, when I feel in danger. Speaking of danger, let me lock my doors again. Since the officer did help me, he pushed me out the road. Because my, my whole back was in the road, like somebody like almost hit me, and that just freaked me out. And some of y'all gonna comment down below, like, why are you crying? It's not that serious. When you're fed up, you're tired, and you've been pushed down for a whole year, you get to cry. So I'm going to just, yeah, I'm letting it out now because I, I refuse to have a bad night. I'm trying not to have a bad night, and I'd rather cry now than cry later. It could always be worse. That's what I need to, f to think. It could always be worse. Big Beulah is done. Like, I just don't get it. You're doing so good, Big Beulah. But yeah, I'm just sitting in her now. Waiting on Triple A to tell me. She won't even excel, y'all. Y'all should see how close these cars are to my car. People are texting me and calling me and trying to make sure I'm okay. I got all my stuff back here. And like, I'm in somebody's yard. That's what's crazy. So, yeah, I just wanted to keep y'all updated. This is the real Derrick's birthday. Let me answer this phone call.
Um, it's January 1st at 5.08. I have taken off all my makeup today. And, um, yeah, I'm just sitting here watching TV. Excuse my house. I'm just watching TV. I'm watching the um, New York Giants and Redskins game. I can see. I don't really care who wins because I um, watched the Panthers game earlier against we play the um, the Buccaneers and we lost. I was a little sad about that, but we're just gonna say this season was a nice season. <laughs> I'm a um, Carolina Panthers fan because I'm from Charlotte, I don't know, and I love Cam Newton. You know, this wasn't her year. But anyway, um, I'm just sitting here chilling. Uh, I know I left the scene before last, a little emotional crying, but it ended on a good note. Um, I didn't bring my camera into the um, into the club because there's just too much going on. And I didn't know they, they allow cameras and they try to keep up with it. Oh, excuse me. It was just too much. So, um, I just left my camera in the car and I had a really good time. We went to Scorpio's last night. Me and, um, three of the girls had a good time. It was really no drama, really. Um, I ended up going with the two piece. The dress didn't fit right in it and find the, um, thing to go with it, the corset thing to go with it, so uh, I don't know if I'm going to take it back, because I haven't worn it, if I'm just keep it, I don't know, I have no clue yet, but um, yeah, we got some from my Snapchat, and from my friend's Snapchat, she recorded the night, it was really good, I had a good time, and I got a lot of compliments on my outfit, and everything. Um, and I ended up not wearing the boots with my outfit either. It's just my whole outfit did not go as it was in my head. So I ended up making it work, and I liked it. Um, I stayed at a hotel last night because we were intoxicated and we wanted to be safe. So that was good. Um, I think I'm, I'm just basically giving y'all a run through what happened last night. Um, some guy like try to grab my booty and try to kiss my friend, which was interesting, but that was about it. Um, cookout was acting crazy like always. They act crazy in Fayetteville and they act crazy in Charlotte. Wendy's was acting crazy. So, um, I ended up not eating after last night, after the club. I just ended up falling asleep in the car. I think um, one of my friends got a Snapchat of that. Snapchat picture of that. So I'm going to tell her to send it to me and put it in this vlog. So y'all know. The real Darian. She's not a... She's a, she's a grandma. I'm such a grandma. Um, but yeah. Um, my car's still broken down. Got it towed to my house. And my mom ended up having to drop me off. And my friends drove. I wasn't driving anyway. But uh, also we went to a masquerade party um, before we went to the club, and that was really good. Got to meet my friends. Um, I don't know, that's my mom coming. Okay, sorry. Uh, that was my mom trying to figure out what we we're gonna eat for dinner because my aunt Tan's here. Her birthday um, was she's a uh, New Year's Eve baby, so she came down to Charlotte to spend some time with us, and she mainly spent some time with us. I had a good time. I hope my mom called me again. But yeah, um, I might vlog a little bit more today and then, yeah, that's about it. But alright, see y'all later in the next scene or maybe vlog. Well, I don't know yet.